instructions. Okay, gentlemen, main event, back up, Nick, back up. Elite XC Lightweight Championship of the World, five, five minute round. Any questions from here? Any questions from here? Good luck, man. Go back to your corner. Right here, Nick. John L. Sullivan was the first heavyweight boxing champion of the world. The Green Bay Packers, the first NFL Super Bowl champs. The first Major League Baseball World Series champion was Boston. Tonight, November 10th, 2007, another first takes place as Elite XC crowns its first 160-pound world champion. Who is it going to be? Nick Diaz or KJ Nunes? We're about to find out. And notice how they don't touch gloves. shot by news. Very vivid illustration of the reach advantage by Diaz snatching that single leg. Nunes defending it along the cage. It's a smart game plan already for Nick Diaz. We know he can bang standing up, but Nunes has got such a pedigree for stand-up fighting. Nice escape by Nunes. Again, Nick Diaz, accumulative punching, constant movement. This guy's participated in triathletes. Days after Body the hospital. KJ has got to be careful because he's dipping his head to his right. But Nick Diaz telegraphing the shot a bit. Nunes able to sprawl. What I was getting to is that Nick Diaz, if he's got a left roundhouse kick, if KJ moves his head to the right, throw the hit. Nick's an extremely tactical fighter. It's really, really interesting to watch him. KJ fighting out of that crowd to landing that right hand at will to the body and stuffing all these takedowns. Doing a very good job of stuffing the Nick Diaz takedown attempts. KJ Nunes, very, oh, he gets tagged there by the right hand, and that's the one thing, constant movement, just like wow. Nick Rabbit in the commercial is Nick Diaz. Can't take a lot of those guys later on. If it goes later, it, uh, those are going to accumulate. KJ Nunes with a boxing pedigree. Nick Diaz also 1 0 as a pro boxer. He has trained with former WBA and WBC world champion Lucita Espinosa. Nunes blocked that roundhouse and tags Diaz with that right hand. KJ's gained a little confidence right here that he's stuffing those takedown attempts. Tries to uh, stuff him with that knee that uh, Edson Berto saw in his last time. Now. And that time, gets the knee, but Diaz looking for the takedown along the fence and manages to secure it. He scooped that double leg and didn't give it up until News was on his back. And uh, Diaz has got a cut. Diaz doing a good job of breaking the guard. Uh-oh. Wow. Nice escape by KJ News midway through round one. Nunes putting on a little razzle-dazzle with that escape. And yes, a cut over the right eye of Nick Diaz. And if you remember in the meetings, Nick brought to our attention, don't be surprised if I get cut early in the fight. Seems to be over both eyes. Stick and move, like I said earlier, guys. 
stick and move. Rhodes trying to come in at angles. Diaz now trying to hunt him down with those peppering left shots. And again, it may look like Nick Diaz is not hurting his opponent, but again, it's the cumulative effect. This is the Nick Diaz strategy. Peppering KJ Nunes now in the final minute. And let's remember what Diaz's face looked like in the Gomi fight when he absolutely destroyed him at the end. Another straight right from Nunes. There goes the mouthpiece. Nunes is using a lot of head movement and avoiding most of the significant shots that Diaz is throwing so far. You gotta wonder if uh, if Diaz sustains this for a couple rounds, how is the cardio gonna come into play? Are you surprised at KJ Nunes' takedown defense at all, Stephen? No, I'm not because we saw a great takedown defense against uh, Berto, and but against someone like. Nick Diaz, who is so well schooled on the ground, and again with that reach and height advantage, it's been around that Dudley belongs to KJ Nunes as Diaz tries for the takedown again. We're at the end of round one, a great opening five minutes Beautiful. as Diaz and Nunes battle for the Elite XC 160 pound world title. of what KJ did against Berto. It was a beautiful counter to a shot. He's got a good instinct to do that. and throwing that counter right hand which put Diaz down. It's over. The fight has been stopped. Dr. Robert Williams, who was looking closely at the cuts over Nick Diaz's left right. eye and the bridge of his nose, has deemed Nick 